Did you forget where you came from? Where You Came From is a big part of the soon to be released movie Last Call. It's all about Delco and it's written by Upper Darby High School grad turned successful real estate developer turned first time screenwriter Greg Lingo. He and his childhood buddies combined all their stories from growing up here. Friends and neighborhood and friends, parents and local bars, that all kind of formulated who we became. Greg got the script to a producer and even he admits he was surprised at the level of actors that wanted in. Jeremy Piven is the main character, a successful guy who goes back to help save his old stomping grounds. It's like you've been standing there for 12 years, you're still a health nut. I yeah. love it. Taryn Manning is in the film, Kathy Moriarty, along with Upper Darby natives Sherry O'Terry and Jamie Kennedy. But Tina Fey, the queen of Upper Darby comedy? We did reach out. Yeah, she was unavailable at the time. They did get well respected actor Bruce Dern, who had a soft spot for the script. He went to the University of Penn, so he said, I know Upper Darby. I used to golf at Cobbs Creek. The movie sure captures the Delco feel, but it isn't specifically about Greg and his buddies. And the name of the town in the film, you're not going to find it on any Delco map. Darby Heights. Some places never change. Yeah, there's no Darby Heights. We, uh, we kind of combined Upper Darby and Clifton Heights and put them together and thought that would be fun. It is fun. The movie bounces between Delco and one other part of our area. No reason to leave except if you go to the shore. If you're not from Delco, Greg says you'll just enjoy the fun comedy. If you do know Delco, he hopes the movie will give you the warm fuzzies for the kinds of people and the kinds of places you remember here. We have a three stain policy. If you have more than three stains on your shirt, you can't get it. It feels like Upper Darby, but it's really just, a, it's a story. It's a story about friendship. It's a comedy about friendship. In Delco, Tim Furlong, NBC 10 News.